I've been around here a lot longer than you guys, and guys out here have been around a lot longer than I've been around will tell you. All this is, is that all of a sudden, you think you want a little bit of land. Oh, get the band ready! Got the band and jump! You think you want to go out to Montville and change your lifestyle, because you don't want to be in New London, because somehow New London's not good enough. Well, you know what? Every damn player I see around here lately worth the damn, where are they from? That's a great football team over there with athletes all over the place. And tonight, at some point, you're going to get knocked down. And the only thing we ask, every guy in pads, every coach on the staff, the every parent in the stands, get up. Oh, oh, my dog, Dad, oh, oh, it's it's call it ain't call my field call. It ain't call who wants to call. It ain't call no one's call. It ain't damn sure ain't no legend call. It's who wants to call. And we come here to take the dog. Do not give in. Every shot they get, get back up. It will break them. They deferred. You know why they deferred? They think they're going to onside kick it and get the ball any damn way. Come on, Nick Angel, get this thing for me. Mayfield with a onside kick. We thought we might see that early owing, and we did. Good job, Trent. Why did, no, why did anybody go for it? Senior quarterback, Melquan Gomez under center. Efren Santiago, handoff up the middle to Commander. Commander looking to the bounce to the outside. He's got the sideline. Commander's at the 20-yard line. Cuts it again. Gets a block from Roman. He's at the five. He cuts it one more time in. Touchdown, New London Whalers. No flags. First play of the game. 6-0. What a start. Why did we run a, Why didn't we have any outside backer to this side of the field? We didn't have any outside backer to this side of the field. Lopez and Loyer to the left. Commander's the set. Pitch right to Commander. Commander trying to get to the outside. Use the speed. Cuts it back inside. Touchdown, Whalers. Jacob Commander. We're doing what we want right now, despite all of it. We're keeping this thing close. Yep. We're ugling it up a little bit. We're going to get out of here down two scores. And then the second half, you know, we get the ball. Get one. Now we got a game. Hand off to Satiro. And he is buried again before he gets to the offensive line. Hit hard on the play. Coming up from his linebacker spot was. Keon Wilbur. Roman, straight drop, pressure. Throws deep down the sideline into double coverage and it's caught by Roman. Gomez, straight drop, looking to throw. Deep down the sideline, looking for Gio Lopez and he's got him with a leaping catch inside the 10 yard line. Gomez, under center. Gomez to throw, has some time, plenty of time. Steps up, tucks it in, puts his head down, heads for the goal line. Waiting for a signal, a touchdown, Melquan Gomez. Get knocked down, get up. You get knocked down, you get up. Just gotta keep playing defense. You're playing like a bunch of wild animals out there. Just run around and tackle people. You're doing a great job. Keeping us right there in the game. You gotta understand something. Being satisfied is not what we're about at New London. We're about trying to be the best we can be. And we weren't that in the first half. See, there are a lot of people who are going to run around and say, the scoreboard's enough. It's not enough. Second and five for the Indians. But same play on that little end around again to Clark. He's got another first down in the open. Crosses the 40 down to the 35-yard line. That's the second time they've run that play, and there's something brewing there with that. Are you kidding me, that damn play? Does anybody tell me what happened on that play that that is working? When we know it's coming? Clark is the wing. They do that inside reverse to Clark. Ball on the turf. And it's going to be recovered by Elijah Parker at the 27-yard line. He went inside. He's supposed to be behind him. Blue call, under center, straight drop, has time. Now he's pressured, and down goes Hall, sacked by Dante Ford. And the turnover on downs for the Indians. Throw the ball. I know you guys throw. I know. We didn't pick up the kid off the edge. First and 10, handoff up the middle to Commander. Commander bounces off the tackle, still on his feet, doesn't go down, all the way to the first down. Jacob Commander that time refused to let his knees touch the ground. He used his hand to stay up, and finally Jack Ware brought him down. But oh, what a tough run by Commander, that low center of gravity. Yeah. Melquan Gomez hands off to Commander. Commander's got some room. Commander's got the sideline. Commander cuts it back inside. Commander's at the 20, inside the 20, and wrestled down at the 15 yard line. First 10 Whalers with the 18. Hand off of the gun. It goes to Commander. Commander breaks a tackle. Commander still on his feet. And Jacob Commander, we salute you. Touchdown, Whalers. Rolls right, wants to throw. Deep down the field, he's looking for Bradley Johnson, and it's intercepted by Monty Johnson at the 42 yard line. Monty! Monty! You will be. 
you were beat on that foot. He was behind you. Stop falling asleep at the wheel. Way to recover, damn it. Ball, straight drop, looking to throw, pressured, and he's sacked. All the way back at the 10-yard line by Major Roman. Gomez under center, straight drop, looking to throw, looking in the corner for Roman. Roman with a jump ball with Johnson, and a touchdown! Major Roman, how did he take that away from Bradley Johnson? But he did. Wow, what a play, Major Roman. 52 total yards for the Montville Indians this far season. Clark with another line drive punt, scooped up by the Whalers, and rumbling towards the end zone, touchdown! New London High School on the wackiest punt return you will ever see. You know why we're a really good team? Because we won 41 to nothing and nobody here is happy. Because we all know we could have dropped 60 if we executed. We got five of these things left. Five of them. And we've got a great opportunity to get right back on track, to get right back where we want to be, to start winning games again. But it's going to take every guy on the roster at 100% to get there. Winning is always better than losing, but we can be exponentially better.